Yeah, Dewan, but we still have a lot of questions in this case. So those indictments, those indictments were brief. They read the same for both brothers. It indicated that the men murdered and killed Deputy Ned Berg with the Wake County Sheriff's Office. No, you're looking right now at 25 year old Alder Alfonso Marine Sotelo. He is the second man who was arrested a week ago in Burke County on unrelated charges. He's being held in Forsyth County, but is expected to be moved to Wake County at some point today, though he is facing those murder charges. At least 12 of the 18 jurors moved to indict the men accused in the death of Deputy Ned Byrd. The indictment, though, did not indicate the role each of these brothers played in Byrd's death, and that is a big question. A lot of people want to know how these men are involved. Now, also last week, 29-year-old Arturo Marine Sotelo stood before Wake County judge on murder charges in Byrd's death. He remains in jail with no bond and is due back in court next month. Bird was shot to death sometime between August 11th and August 12th in eastern Wake County. Bird had been with the department for 13 years. Since his death, there's been an outpouring of support for the fallen deputy. Bird was laid to rest last Friday with a hero's homegoing. I also heard from the sheriff's office this evening. They told me they couldn't comment because this is still a very open investigation. There's still more to come. They wouldn't say, though, if there are any additional charges or arrests coming down. That is something that we would look for. And, of course, if any of that happens, we'll bring you the very latest. Dewan and Lauren.